HookahPro.com, your ultimate source for everything hookah. Find the latest tips and tricks, videos, reviews, contests, and more. Hello, this is uh, Shisha. Shishologist uh, from Hookah Pro and uh, Sunshine. Hello. Um, we're doing a review of uh, two different things in this video. I just decided to just compress it into one thing. I've already done two reviews today and I'm really tired. It's about two in the morning. And uh, we're doing a review of uh, coal and the uh, a tobacco from Nakla. The two products are right here. Um, first, let's <coughs> put this aside and uh, do the review of Coco Brico. Uh, these coals, uh, I've been using them for about like a month or so. They're really good. Uh, they pack a lot of heat. They pack a really big punch. I mean, I'm only using one coal and I'm getting some pretty big... I mean, not big, big epic clouds out of it. I mean, I'm pretty sure that using two coals is a lot better. Um, I just decided to save a little money and just uh, use one coal. <laughs> uh, the coals come in uh, cube, in the cube form. Um, let me show you right here how they look like. They're about yay big. You notice? I have some pretty big hands on them. Whatever. Just. Uh, a cube. You notice if you notice some of the stuff rubs up on me. I mean, some of the carbon, whatever. They're made of uh, pure coconut. Uh, it says here it's small but powerful. I attested that. Uh, sufficient for barbecue for four to five persons. I guess it's also used for barbecue. It has a duration. It says it has a duration of 2.5 hours, but I usually get like an hour and a half out of it. A mm -hmm. session of an hour and a half. I, I, it, it's not really honest when it says that. Um, but the quality is good. Yeah, it's a good quality coal. Um, like uh, Sunshine said. Uh, let's see. Uh, it's produced in Indonesia, I guess in the same country. I think coconuts are also produced in that country. Um, it says here it's 100% natural, burns two times longer than any, two times longer, sorry, than any other charcoal. I don't really believe that. I think uh, I've used other charcoals, I've used green plains, and they burn just about as long. Um, I guess it burns like one and a half times longer. Uh, it says it's more economic to use, I detested that, and it's an environmentally friendly product. Well, I have no way to test that. Um, it says that not a single tree was felled to make this product. In other words, they didn't cut down any trees, they just took a coconut and they, they just compressed the shell. And uh, I guess they made it out of a coconut shell. Uh, so, if you're a, that kind of person that wants to save the trees, I guess uh, this is a good product to use. Let's tell them that there's more clean. Um, it's a lot cleaner. It, it, I really get no taste of charcoal when I'm smoking it. Um, smoking with it, sorry. I don't smoke charcoal. <laughs> uh, the calorific value is actually per kilogram 7,400 kilocalories. That's 31,000 kilojoules per kilogram. 75% uh, um, fixed carbon. It says 14% volatile matter. 3% uh, ash. It barely ashes. <coughs> and 8% uh, moisture, it says here. Uh, the box is a recycled box, and that's all I have to say about it. Let me show you how it looks like when it's burning. Looks like that. Big. Really mm -hmm. big, freaking coal. Mm -hmm. All right, let me show you the clouds that come out of this thing. It's just one coal, one coal used on a very deep bowl. I underpacked it actually, and it's still getting a very decent amount of smoke out of it. 
I mean, let me show you just once again for you to see because I'm pretty damn proud. <laughs> I'm like a damn rooster when it comes to the clouds. <laughs> and if you do it right, you don't cough like crazy because uh, the quality is really good. I know those aren't the biggest clouds you've ever seen, but they're pretty good for just one cold, right? Yeah. Anyway, let's continue with the review. This is uh, Nakla Mixed Fruits. Uh, it says fruits flavor. It doesn't quite describe it so much, but you can feel a hint uh, of uh, many different fruits with it. And it shows the picture. It shows a picture of all the fruits they put in it, I guess. Um, yeah, let me uh, tell you a little bit about the smell. Uh, <coughs> maybe George, you can do this. Uh, sunshine, sorry. Sure. It has a fruit smell, no. but you can't tell uh, what is exactly until you smoke it. Yeah, my yeah, opinion... It has a smell more like a banana. Yeah, I feel a lot of banana smell. I feel like it smells like those air fresheners in the car. You know, <laughs> like if you put an air freshener in the car, it kind of smells like this. Um, it even tastes like it. Uh, it's not exactly something I recommend for the light of heart because it tastes really pretty strong. Um, let me move the coal a little bit because I think the smoke is going to start getting a little harsh. All right. Um, well, of course, the cut is just like any other nakla cut. It's just that it's a lot lumpier and it's a little bit stickier than what I'm usually used to from nakla. Uh, let me show you. Yeah, it's a bunch. It's a bunch of clumps, basically. <coughs> And it has a lot of stems. Uh, I already filled the, the box. box. All right, we got seven minutes on the video. Crap. So, uh, buzz is pretty strong. I mean, uh, this time I really did a really good session. Um, the clouds you've already seen it is pretty good. Um, just like any other knock line. I mean, I, I. I I, I think it's like a rule of thumb. Every time you smoke nakla, you're gonna expect some pretty big clouds if you set it up correctly. Uh, the taste. Let me taste it again. Tastes like a uh, air freshener. <laughs> Taste. Uh, I give this one like a 7 out of 10 only because it tastes like a damn air freshener. I like it. I'll smoke it. I'll continue smoking it. Uh, some people don't like it. I actually like it. Um, Sunshine here likes it a lot. Uh, <coughs> for the clouds, of course, as always, a 9 out of 10. Um, mm. I'll give it 8 out of 10 for taste. Because I still feel the banana flavor, the ananas, and the apple that it shows right here. The strawberries, I, I don't. So I, I think predominantly it's more of a pineapple kind of flavor, but since it's so mixed up, it feels like they just gumped every tobacco that they had left for fruits and just put it all together into one big flavor. Um... Well, that's all I have to say about it, so this is uh, Shishologist. And uh, for the smoke, I'll give it like a 9. Uh, okay, yeah, that, that's what I said too. I mean, we both mm -hmm. give it a 9 for clouds. So this is uh, Shishologist and Sunshine signing out uh, uh, for this review. Uh, I'm really sleepy, so. Hey.